this the treasure map? <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Oh, this is gonna be cool. <laughs> this is getting cool. Okay. Well, we're So I have taken the last three to four weeks planning a surprise one year anniversary for my boyfriend. It is a scavenger hunt that has taken me so long <laughs> to put together and I'm so super excited about it. He has absolutely no idea what's going on. He does know we're doing something, but he doesn't know the extent of which um, I have gone to pull all of this off. There are several people involved. There are several props involved. Um, but I just finished up the finishing touches about an hour ago. It was pouring down rain where it's going to be. So I hope that it's not pouring down rain. I thought that was him. I hope it's not pouring down rain when we get there. But, um, so tonight marks the night that he sent me my first message. So my first message from him was sent at like 2.43 a.m. So it hasn't happened yet. So I thought it'd be kind of cool to start it tonight, like leading up to, because technically we didn't know each other yet a year ago. It's like hours before he texted me. And then our official like big day starts at 10 tomorrow. So I'm so excited. I hope he likes it. I'm going to try to record a, a lot of it so that we can keep this and hold this as a memory of how fantastic it was. Um, so his very first gift is going to be given. Sorry, I keep thinking he's like coming and I keep looking this way because I'm looking out of our patio door and this is like the main road right here so i keep waiting for his truck uh so the first gift is actually in this bottom drawer and it's a gift um with the first clue in it so super excited so i'm gonna get ready he's not home yet he was actually so excited and so giddy he got home at like at one when i told him he didn't have to be home until five so he called me up he's like hey i'm like no not yet so i had to actually mix work because today's friday i'm working with trying to plan this so it's been I've been all over the place driving and trying to get this done. My heart's been going a million miles an hour. I'm just, was so stressed, but I got it all done and all figured out with like two hours to spare. So I didn't think I was gonna get home and like done until around 5, 5.30. And I actually was pretty much, like could have been home before four. So I feel good about that. But then that's what happens when you're really organized and you make lots of lists. So anyways, I'm going to get going. I'm going to see if maybe I can set up a light or something here so it's nice and bright when I record. We'll see. I'm so excited. <laughs> I love him so much. And I, I hope he enjoys it. He has so many people that are trying to make this good for him. Complete strangers that are really excited for us. So... Are you excited? Mm -hmm. Remember, we haven't met yet. Oh, we haven't met yet. I know. Do you know when we meet? Tomorrow. There's your gift right there. Oh, why? We said we weren't doing this, babe. Okay, get it out, love. <laughs> Is it a puppy? <laughs> No, it's kind of heavy and I didn't want to ruin it. I thought it was like, go. Okay, read it. Read from, out loud. From day, from day one, I knew we had a touch in common. From day four, I knew your heart was open. From day three, I knew that this was more than a summer fling. 
I love you. These three words unlock my heart and I knew an adventure was in my future. Okay, love. Open it up. It's so pretty. Thank you. Look at the detail, the heart stickers. Mm -hmm. Did you wrap this yourself? Mm -hmm. Wow, it's really good. Thanks, love. You could work at Bloomingdale's. <laughs> It's green. Hey, it's always oh, oh, look at the detail. You might need your pocket knife, love. I certainly hope it's not a live animal in there because <laughs> you'd be freaking no, stabbing it no, to I'm death. With surgical precision. Pre <laughs> precision. I, I might have just gotten it there though. <laughs> Oh my. Wow, I feel like Keanu Reeves <laughs> in the movie Speed. <laughs> I the, don't remember that the part. the bus, he's like taking the bomb apart. Oh. Oh my goodness, this is insane. <laughs> All right, read the next card first. Okay. I hope I cut the right wire. <laughs> One year ago tonight, you sent me a message, a message, a message that opened up your life into my life. I feel that deserves a celebration. For the next twenty-four hours, <gasps> a treasure hunt meant to surprise you and fill you with love. Follow the clues, open your heart, and embrace the moments to come. We talked about this. I know, love. Is this the treasure map? <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Oh, this is gonna be cool. <laughs> this is getting cool. Okay. Well, we're. You've already got the clues, so you have to figure it out. Well. So, um. You have everything, so. So, uh, well, day one, I, I, I clued it. You know, <clears throat> I clued into, I didn't say anything, but I'm like, it's interesting that you're talking out of order in your comments here, like day three <laughs> after day four. I didn't say anything, but I was coming up. That's cute. So this is probably what it is. Day one, and then day four. Oh, this is adorable. <laughs> Day three. Now, what does it one and four three stand for? Do you know? Beeper. In beeper days, what does one four three stand for? I was pretty innocent. I didn't do any of that. I really. Yeah. I didn't know that. Mm. I had like the same girlfriend for twenty years, <laughs> and she didn't know that, so I didn't. Know that. <laughs> wow. We'll see if it works, love. <gasps> Oh, I'm so nervous. This is, this is. Wow, there sure are plenty of fish in here. <laughs> I mean, I don't know how many, but there's plenty. Oh my God, what is this? What, tell me these aren't clues, Pat. You have to read the envelope. It says open. Drew? Love, open your envelope. Guys, you dated? <laughs> No! <laughs> Crap. <laughs> I feel like these might be important, maybe. I have been searching for a man like you in POF. Stands for plenty of fish. And poof, but yeah. It's supposed to say poof, from but the, yeah. Poof. It's another clue. Oh. Okay. From the moment we met, I knew out of all the fishes in the sea, you were the one meant for me. <laughs> First clue, find us. It's going to take a while. Oh, find us. 
find our fish. Dane. Okay. The good. first one wow. I grabbed. Good what job. What is that meant to say? I All wonder. right. Next one. So Dane. C. C. <laughs> God, this is cool. <laughs> so cool. Dane. And then I imagine I gotta find a Sabrina fish. <laughs> yes. And Sabrina's favorite color is green. So might she be green? Or maybe she maybe didn't remember that, but I think she maybe did. Or is there a really beautiful sparkly fish in here? Because that would be her. There's a lot of greens. Put them to one side so they don't get mixed up. Sam, I'm gonna have to quiz you later to see. Should we go sit down and have a coffee while I do this? <laughs> I think that's Sabrina. Inside. See inside. See inside. See inside. Oh, this is really great. See inside of something. See inside. See inside. See inside. Inside C. Hmm. I'm stuck. Um, Don't think too hard. See inside. See inside. I don't know, love. See inside of something. This is the coolest case ever. Did you come up with this? Mm hmm. The whole thing, love. See inside. I feel kind of dumb. <laughs> feel inside. See inside. See inside of what? Inside here? There's a key. There's always a key. Did you forget to put it in here? Or? <laughs> no, love. You have to see inside of something. It's all in front of you. And then what's left? Okay. I'm brilliant! <laughs> see inside. No way. This is like the Da Vinci Code. <laughs> How did you get it in there? In the town that Mr. Doodles died, seven miles past the swim town Ave, you will see the, the Atlantic at the gate of the sea. Hurry, the salmon is expecting you at 745. This is like the movie. Dress to impress, as always. So Mr. Doodles, we know is in Del Rey. Mm -hmm. Okay, number okay. one. Point seven miles past the swim town Ave. You will see the Atlantic at the gate of the sea. Okay, I've got to go get closer to the ocean to figure yes. it out. Yes, so we got to get dressed. Okay. Okay, love. That's great. Do you oh, like it, love? So, mm. so, so incredibly creative. Thank you, love. And well done. And I can't even imagine the time that you spent in doing this. Mm -hmm. Lots of time, love. But you're worth it, love. The expressions on your face are priceless. Are you ready to get dressed I am. to impress? I'm super excited. What are we wearing? Okay, so there's only three things that you need to bring besides dressing to impress, and you're not allowed to ask any questions. Can I ask First, what you're wearing? Yeah. Yeah, I'm wearing a dress. You're going to see me. But there's three other things that you need to bring. Okay. First one is your regular glasses. Okay. Second one is your sunglasses. Okay. And third one is your deodorant. And that's it. Okay? Oh. And then dress to impress, love. Are you ready? I am. Okay. Kind of funny. You look good driving this, love. It's, very, it's like a baseball glove. Hey, do you have your clues? Well, absolutely. Well, you need your top one to know where you're going, love. I have them conveniently stowed away in my little keeper pocket here. All right. So, Dr. Doolittles. So, something tells me there's a lot of talk about the Atlantic Ocean in here. Seatbelt, love. So I'm thinking that we should head on a So, Sabrina, 
my girlfriend, right? Yeah. She made this treasure hunt, and I'm trying to get to this place because I'm, I believe there's a salmon waiting for me. <laughs> I think that's like the kind Wait, you eat. So she made a she made a, a treasure hunt. Right. So okay. I'm I'm dry, I'm going down Atlantic, and, and I have to, reading this a is, clue. I'm reading a clue. Listen to this clue and help me, because I can phone one friend, and I'm phoning you, my friend. <laughs> You're my number one friend. I'm phoning. <laughs> So it says, okay. in the town that Dr. Doolittle's died, which is Del Rey, because the Dr. Doolittle shop that closed down, died down, Del Rey. Okay. It says, 0.7 miles past the Swimtown Avenue, you will see the Atlantic at the gates of the sea. Hurry, a salmon is expecting to see me at 7.45. Dress to impress. I got that part done. The dressing part's done. But... I I need to know what's the gate of the sea at the Atlantic. Where would I go for the salmon? Gate? Says the point, sea so, gate? Sea gate? Is that a restaurant? The sea gate? No, it's a hotel. Oh, is it right on the beach? It's near the beach. It's not right on the beach. Okay, so listen. If I'm driving down Atlantic, is it going to be on my left? Is I'm heading towards it's the ocean? It's going to be on your right. It's a Seagate Hotel, you think? Yeah. <laughs> so we established that Swimtown is actually a synonym? No, a, a significance? It's a play on words. A play on words for Swinton, Swinton. which we just freaked out about because we just realized <laughs> that. Swinton Avenue, much like Swimtown Avenue. No wonder so, when I phoned my friend, he didn't know what that was all about. Okay, so then what's the next clip? Okay, so 0.7 miles. Past. Past. The Swinton, or Swim Town, in other words. And then where are you, what are you looking for now? Because you got that part, now what? I'm looking for the Atlantic at the gate of the sea. Which, there... The gate of the sea might a, be... The, now that we've discussed this, it seems like it could be since the sea we, gate. Since we called a friend. Since we phoned a friend, much like do you want much anyway, the sea gate very likely will be up here on our right. It's very good that we did this. Traffic is very heavy and you know it'd be hard to drive safe plus read all the signs, so probably a good move we made, you think? Mm -hmm. We've eaten here at the office, remember? Mm -hmm. We ate there with my brother, and we ate at the farmhouse. We've walked this street many, many times with the kids. Right? Mm -hmm. Friends. All right. So, the sea gate is maybe a hotel, one might say. And being that I cannot figure out the odometer on this rental car, <laughs> I'm just kind of using my manometer to figure out what 0.7 miles would feel like. I'm feeling like I'm almost at 0.4. Point three miles from Swintown Avenue. Seven forty-five. We're doing pretty good on time. It's almost seven fifteen, so we have a half an hour to figure out this place. Park. I feel like it's going to be any minute. I feel like we're getting point six here. Point seven is feeling about right here. This should be it. This feels point seven ish. <gasps> the Seagate. Right there, where would one park at the Seagate? Here's some parking right here. Why don't you pull in here and see if there's a restaurant? I have though. a two hour park. Right parking. here, if you pull in. 8 a.m. to 6 a.m. If you pull in right but here. But it's after 6, I think I can park for free. If you pull in right there. It's after 6, I can park free. If you pull in in there, ask if there's a restaurant. Tell them you're looking for a restaurant. Make sure they have one. Really? 
this floor. Very clicky. Hey, can you direct me to the restaurant? Of course, if we just roll down the hallway to your left, all the way back into the kitchen. Thank you. I almost want to do a little tap dance here. Is she right here? Yeah, she Wow, this is beautiful. Mm -hmm. I've never been here before. Have you? No. Yes. So, interesting. Inter interestingly enough, these are actually quite a nuisance in Japan, and they now have figured out a way to cook these. They eat them without poisoning themselves. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. These are actually like a nuisance. Look at this Mr. Eel right here. He just got his next clue in the bill after dinner. You want to read that? When we, when we first walked in, I thought, roses are red, violets are blue. A man can accept flowers. A man can accept flowers, but can he catch a clue? Well, that's a real head scratcher. We have to go. We have to go search around for stuff. So where should we go? What does it say? When I first walked in, there's something around that area. Maybe was it the aquarium? <laughs> All right, let's go. We're on a hunt. We're on a treasure hunt. I would like to give you one clue though, the, on top of the clue. When we first walked in means into this establishment because this is where we're supposed to go. So not like by our car. That's the clue. That's wow, look at how beautiful. Oh my God. I don't know, but it's so pretty.
any weak than this guy. Is that the GM? It order? might be. Huh? It might be. Ugh. Where did you get him? A special place, love. Check it out. When door, when one door closes, sometimes the next door opens. They're playing hard to get. I'm just giving you a little tour. <laughs> you know. <laughs> That little market on the end, I'm gonna get some orange juice or some, some water or some, some snacks. Mm -hmm. Babe! <laughs> oh! so much. You're so wonderful to me. I love you. I love you. Mm. Wow! How did you do all this? Huh? Well, this is why my computer was at home. You were doing this all day? Yes, love. I was. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I did bring you a little hat, though. Home away from home. Yes, love. What a great room, huh? Mm hmm So nice. Yeah, <coughs> This is amazing. I know. It is really pretty. Oh. Right? Great view, right? I know. I've been here all night. I, mean, this, I should have had the coffee. Just put that around your wrist. Mm -hmm. Isn't that pretty? Let's um, see what the door open. If you want to. Wow, look how gorgeous that room is. Did you put a flower on my bed? Did you do that? I didn't do that, no. That they cool. did that? Mm -hmm. What a gorgeous room. Mm -hmm. <gasps> is that the bathroom? Yeah, I know. I was waiting for I you to say mirror. something. No. Oh. What's your step? Wow! Oh my god, I just... Can I watch you take a bubble bath? <laughs> <laughs> Babe! Isn't it nice? Oh my goodness gracious! And there's your shaving cream since you're all out. Wait, is that for sale or did you bring that? No, I brought that. It's ours. I brought you some shavers. I bought you a new toothbrush. You're so thoughtful. This is so hard for me. <laughs> Why, love? This is so hard. 
Are you surprised? Totally surprised. Never could have guessed this. In a million years. I thought we were going out to dinner. You know what I kind of thought you were going to do? Mm -hmm. I kind of thought. Don't say what you thought because you're still a whole other day. Okay. So let's see. Because <laughs> I'm going to get really. <laughs> if I guess it? Yeah. I'll be sad. I probably won't guess it. Probably won't guess it. I don't think so.